What is up guys, XMOS5 here with another video and today we are going to be playing the hardest map in Call of Duty Zombies, Verrucked. Like, this is the hardest map that's not a custom map. This is, we're finally playing an actual map that, you know, we're not playing one of those stupid custom maps that I do all the time. We're actually playing an actual map in the game. You know, changing it up a little bit, I guess. But today we're gonna be playing Verruck. I've never been a real big fan of Verruck. I'm never, well, and the reason being is because I suck at it. Uh, because Verruck is a very difficult map, and I am not the best zombies player, obviously. Um, but yeah, I thought it'd be a good idea to, you know, challenge myself a little bit and play Verruck. So that is exactly what we are going to do, and I feel like it's. Saying that is a little, is that, I don't know. I feel like, I said, yeah, so today we're going to be playing Verruckt, and obviously I'm in Verruckt, but, yeah, so, okay, th th what's good about spawning on this side, so if you didn't know, you like spawn on, you can spawn on two different sides. What's good at spawning on this side is, what I'm going to do, is I want to use the ICR1, which is just up there, and this is probably, like, the place to be in Verruckt. It's, like, uh, the only place that you can kind of train. You know, and at least the only place that you can train that, I don't know, just a little bit. Verruckt is like a very, very close quarters and tight map and is super difficult. Um, if, if like, if you're like a starting player, like do not play Ver Verruckt. It's just, I mean, it's a good way to get good at the game, but like it's just so difficult because it's just such a small map and I feel like Everybody knows if I that. Don't find ammo, so, I will have to kill them with my breath. yeah, and I, I probably should have uh, turned off the voice volume so I don't have um, Nikolai just uh, not shut up. You know, I'm gonna do that right now. See, every single video, I have this stupid problem where, like, I forget to, you know, adjust the volume correctly. And here's another example. So that's nice. So we'll get we'll get a gobble gum. Sword fillet would be. Th always done swiftly, that's good. But see, we're going to be using the ICR1, and that's 1,500 points. So we'll, let's just get enough real quick. Well, we're obviously not going to be able to get enough, like, right now. But where, where's the zombies? Okay. Oh, you know what's stupid? I just noticed this. I'm gonna, Okay, I'm going to need to turn up the voice volume a little bit. Because apparently, the voice volume also counts for the zombies. Yeah, so that, that would have been pretty difficult, because I wouldn't have been able to hear the zombies at all. So I guess we can't have the voice volume off. So we're going to have Nikolai just not shutting up, but it's fine. So we're going to be using the ICR1. This is kind of a strategy that I've started doing a little bit, because Verruckt is, I don't know. I feel like this is a good strategy, and I don't know, I'm just going to stick with it. I'm not going to try to explain it a lot, but I'm just going to try to stick with it. So, yeah, I'm going to try to stay in the, I'm probably going to stay in this room for the most part of the, for most of the game, and that's kind of what my strategy is, because, I mean, this is like, and you might be looking at this, and you're probably looking at this and be like, this room is tiny, what do you mean this is good for training, and you are correct, this room is tiny, and this map is just so difficult that this is like the only good room from training, to be honest with you, like, I feel like, even, even like, this is such a hard map, like, even, like, you'll see veteran players, like, uh, let me think of somebody popular, like the Smith, the Smith Plays, or Tim Hansen, or just any Zombies YouTuber, they'd all agree that Verrucked is a very difficult map, even for them. And, like, yeah. So, that's why we, I, I don't know why I'm playing this, why am I torturing myself by playing this map. But this map is generally fun, right? I actually enjoy this game, this map, a lot. But it's just, I don't play it a lot. Uh, because I suck at zombies, and I don't make it very far in Verruckt. But today, we're going to change this. My goal... Um, this isn't a high goal at all, don't get me wrong. But I'm going to go for 15 or 16. I think my highest on Verruckt is like 27. Yeah, my high... Uh, I think it's something like that. My highest on Verruckt is like 27. So I'm just going to go for 16. Just because I don't want this to, like, this to be a super long video. And yeah, so that's why I'm going for round 15. Okay, double. Oh gosh, I thought I killed him. And I just missed all those points. 
Varok is such a creepy map too. It's like the scariest map in zombies. Like you, like if you just have your headphones on and like max volume, you have you hear all these like screaming sound effects and stuff. It's like really creepy. It is the creepiest map in zombies. Like hands down, the creepiest. So I'm gonna go and turn on the power. Let me unlock the door over here that leads us to the power. You gotta collect the points here. Okay, one more door. Yeah, hopefully this is not that expensive. Yep, that's good. Turn on the power. Hit the box. Let's do that. Oh gosh, dude, the frame rates just drop. <laughs> the bootlegger. That is such a great weapon. It's gonna run out of ammo like in a second. Oh my. Yeah, it's gonna. The bootlegger is gonna run out in a second because the ca ammo capacity is horrible. But yeah, but now that we got the power on. We have access to, um, yeah, we have access to Juggernog right here. That's obviously something that we need. I mean, that's like the number one thing. If you're going for high rounds or just, just any time you're playing zombies, I never just, I never pass up on Juggernog. And where is that last zombie? I can't even hear him. Where's he at? Yeah, what? This isn't even that big of a map. How can I lose a zombie? I hear him. Is he still breaking? That's not the last zombie. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can get pretty scared easily. I found that you can get uh, scared pretty easily on this map because like this is such like. Oh my gosh. The frame rates just like jumped off a building. Holy crap! You see that? But anyways, it, I. I I don't know, because like you can like just walk around the corner. It's just such a tight place that so you're just gonna get met with zombies in every turn, and that's why I love it so much. All right, okay, hey buddy. So I think once once I get jug, I'm gonna feel good. Oh wow, I think I got a little too close there. I'm not gonna even lie. Okay. Oh my gosh, you did not see me miss like. Most of those. Okay, yeah, I'm just so used to aimbot. Or, yeah, aim assist on, like, because I used to play console. Because, like, I'm. Or I do play console mostly. Because I'm literally playing with a controller plugged into my computer right now. So, I'm just so used to aim assist. And it feels weird. The bootlegger is so good. But, the, yeah, like I said, the ammo is not the greatest. Okay. I think the bootlegger actually is a wall weapon. Somewhere, I think it's. Oh yeah, it's in that like this stupid door in Varuk, like that's cost that I don't know. May actually maybe that. Okay, let's get Jug first. I keep on forgetting that we need to do that. Yes. Okay, we got Jug, so I feel good. So now let's open this. Okay, I'm. Yeah. So look, so I think this is a bootlegger. Is this the? Yes, this is the bootlegger. But look, it costs two thousand five hundred for ammo. That, that's a lot, because usually on a weapon, you usually spend, like, 500 for a refill on ammo, right? On, like, a wall weapon, but that is 2,500. That is, uh, pretty expensive. Wait, why am I waiting to get that? Okay, what, I'm so used to, like, this this map just being so hectic, and it's, like, kind of weird that, there you go. Okay, yeah, we need more ammo for our ICR-1. Maybe I should just drink instead. I saw like a Smith plays um, top five, I think it's what, yeah, top five um, of the best uh, assault weapons or assault rifles. And he said that ICR-1 was like, I think he said ICR-1 was like, it's, I think he's like said top three or something like that. But I would, I would actually agree with that. The ICR-1 is such a great weapon. I think it's really kind of underrated. I mean, even I kind of underrated, underrated it a little bit because like whenever I like, first started playing i thought it was bad but it's not bad it's just that i wasn't going for headshots and sometimes on the high rounds we obviously got to do that speed cola would be pretty nice as well but you know can't get everything well i can i will get speed cola maybe at one point once i i'm gonna see what i do is i i'm just gonna rack it well obviously everybody does this but i'm just gonna rack up a bunch of points and then go get it okay 
Yeah, so so far on these early rounds, it's not very difficult. Well, depending on the side that you spawn on. Because, you know, t in my opinion, this is my favorite side to spawn on. The one that I spawned on. Oh my gosh. Wait. Oh! I spawned on my favorite side because, like, you have this big area to start out with. But the other side is actually pretty difficult to start on, in my opinion. But Racking up some... Nice. Oh, wow, okay. So, I think that... No, I, it's going to be smarter to go this way, instead of going through all those doors. Yeah, it's going to be way smarter to... This might be a mistake on doing... You know, let's just stay here for a second. Let's rack up a little bit more points. Let's just get a gobble gum real quick. Oh, yeah, and... There you go, plan, plan, sign. So, why am I doing this video? I, To be honest, I don't know. I... I don't know, I just... I just was kind of playing around on zombies, and I was having fun, and I'm like, you know what? Why not make a video on it, and that's that. That's why we're here right now. Oh, there's Speed Cola. I was, For some reason, I thought it was on the other side. So yeah, I'm only level 8 right now. I feel like I've explained this before, but I'm only level 8 right now because um, I am, like, because I only usually play custom maps on my PC, which I'm on my PC right now. Because I'm usually a PS4 player, and on my PS4, I'm Prestige 11 right now. But, yeah, I don't really play actually play the normal maps on my PC. So that's why I'm only level 8. So, yeah. Because I, like, I, I, re I honestly just got Black Ops 3 on PC just to get custom maps. And, like, for no other reason. Like, I, I've never... I've never gotten on uh, multiplayer or never even touched the campaign. I, I really, really just bought it on my PC for zombies. So how are you guys doing? It's summertime, and uh, yeah, it's summertime. I haven't really done I haven't really done a lot uh, yet. You know, I don't I don't know. I just really haven't done a lot, and uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why. It's just that I've been kind of busy not really but yeah i've just been chilling you know um i'm gonna have a bunch of friends come over on saturday should be fun and go fishing i've really gotten this or into fishing these this uh this summer i mean I, I love fishing but i've really just gotten like back into it you know because I, I i've just gone through like a long streak of not fishing for like forever and i'm getting back into it so that's nice Oh gosh, why did I not see, oh my gosh, you, my aim is just horrendous, and you did not see any of that. <laughs> hopefully this is, I feel like this, hopefully this, I'm, I'm gonna try to make this summer the best I can, oh, I just put myself in a corner like an idiot. Why would I do this, why would I do this? I could have just died so easily. Oh my gosh, that could have been just so bad. You know, that was so dumb. I, what? You know, there's a bunch of zombies. Why don't I just put go in a freaking corner? That's nice. Okay, we have five thousand points. Unfortunately, you cannot pack a punch in this map, which that is another reason this map is just so difficult because you can't pack a punch in it. And I think, yeah, you can't pack a punch on this map. So that makes it just. Just the more difficult. So let's go ahead and get ammo. Maybe we can get some bootlegger ammo as well. No, we don't. Just don't have enough because we need uh, 2,500, but we only have 2,300. It's all right. That's okay. It's, we'll just use the ice here one this round. And I don't. So like I've noticed that like when I record, like that my computer just. I mean, obviously I. I know why, but like my computer just like just does not perform as well when I'm recording. So like it's oh gosh, so it's like not I don't know. It's a little bit laggy as you guys saw. Like the few times like my frame rates would just go just just jump off a building. But now now uh they're they're alright. Cause like at first whenever I like load into a map, it kind of it's kind of um slow at first but then it kind of gets into it okay let's we need ammo so let's try to work ourselves up 
Yeah, let's, yeah. There you go. Okay, let's get the S01. I, okay, we're, we might need to, okay, let's go get a, let's go spin the box. Because I think we might be in a little bit of trouble. Because, uh, we, like, we went through ammo, like, super fast. So, uh, here, we can use implant sight to our advantage right here. Oh, let's go. I'm just kidding, the sheep is horrible. And yes, I did trade out the... I'm gonna use in plain sight. Hold up. The Argus is so good, but I don't. I'm gonna use something else. I'm gonna use in plain sight so I can. Oh, let's go RPK. Couldn't have asked for anything better. I could have, but I didn't. Okay. Let's just obliterate them real quick. Let's not. Yeah. Because once the in plain sight goes away, then we'll be screwed. So let's just try to kill as much as we can. Okay, we have, I think we have really everything that I want. Just everything that I need in a game. We got Jug, uh, Double Tap, and Speed Cola. Not in not in order, but... I didn't say that in order, but... Yeah. We have, like, the four, the three... Four, uh, three of the four crutch perks. Which I, like... I don't really get... I don't get Quick Revive for, like, these... For videos and stuff because like I don't want to like drag out the video a ton right I just want to kind of have the I don't know cuz I don't know cuz sometimes I can make the video it could make the video a little too long but yeah but yeah and sometimes whenever I just want to get a quick game and I just don't get quick revive sometimes I just like just want to go for like around 15 or something and then after that I'll just let myself die and we're 17 minutes right now. We're at 17 minutes. I don't really want it to be too long. So I'm probably not going to be able to get to 15. I'm just going to play it out a little bit. I'm just going to... Yeah. I'm just going to try to play it out like a normal game. And then if we get... Once we get to 20, I'm going to try to like... I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. We'll see. You know, who knows? I might just die on this round. I hate those little, like, streams of water above you, like this, like, make you look like this. They're really annoying. Make the screen look like this, these little streams of water. Is that a nuke? No, I'm not using a nuke. Okay. Oh, they came out. They, they really like, group up really quickly. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow, wow, wow. I just got, like, bombarded right there. Okay, let's not get hit from behind. Nice. Round 12. Let's go. Easy, easy. This is such a fun map, too. Sometimes I, I do say that I do get a little bit bored of those super easy maps. Like, for example, like Kino. Like, I was playing it just uh, about an hour ago, and I was, like, on, tw I was on, like, round 20, and, like, I was, like, kind of bored of it, so I just let myself die. But I feel like this is such a good challenge that you don't really, or this is such a good map that you don't really get to a map, or a, to a round where you are you just give up, because you're just bored. I feel like this is just such a good challenge. This map is, or this map is such a challenge that it makes playing zombies actually fun, you know. Because, like, I, I will say, because of Gobblegums and, you know, your health in Black Ops 3, zombies can be a little too easy. But I think this is... Oh, wow! Oh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, I got stuck. Oh, wow, that's nice. You know, I could have just turned around and uh, shot them, but, you know. I like to go, I like to go the hard way. Because that's dumb. Okay. Well, that's going to be the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I, I know it's not really... There's not really any content to this. It's just kind of... Playing the game of Rucked, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. That was Ace from Us 5, and I'll see you guys in the next one.